Continuing coverage tonight of the death of Ronald Green and hopes of keeping his memory alive. Green's family is hosting a prayer vigil. NBC 10's Valerie Moravi joins us live from Rocky Branch. Valerie, what can you tell us? I'm here in Crossroads where three years ago today, Ronald Green died in Louisiana State Police custody. Now, uh, that's going to be a memory that will remain an open wound uh, for this grieving family seeking for justice. Now, the family tonight is hosting a uh, I'm Your Brother prayer vigil with friends and family, and it will also be open to the public. Now, let me just get off the screen so you guys can see family members and friends. They just started to arrive, and also we can see uh, Ronald Green's mother also being being here. She just arrived uh, just a few minutes ago for this vigil that will start very, very shortly. And just to remind also everyone that these family members were told that, you know, uh, Ronald Green died in a car crash after a high speed chase. And body camera footage also remained as a secret and even withheld from his initial autopsy. Um, now, this is not going to be the only vigil held tonight. The family will be hosting other two more vigils over the weekend, I believe Friday night. Saturday night. So for more updates and more details, you can visit myarclimist.com. Reporting live in Crossroads and Valerie Moravi for your weather station. Thank you, Valerie.